January 24. We were going for a drive, and my father said, We won't be gone long. You come too. And so I went, and we drove and drove until we stopped at a red brick building with a sign in blue letters, Animal Protection Shelter. And inside, we walked down a long cement path, past cages with all kinds of dogs, big and small, fat and skinny, some of them hiding in the corner, but most of them bark, bark, barking, and jumping up against the wire cages we walked past, as if they were saying, me, me, choose me, I'm the best one. And that's where we saw the yellow dog standing against the cage with his paws curled around the wire and his long red tongue hanging out and his big black eyes looking a little sad and his long tail wag, wag, wagging as if he were saying, me, 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 choose me. And we did, we chose him. And in the car, he put his head against my chest and wrapped his paws around my arm as if he were saying, thank you, thank you, thank you. And the other dogs in the cages get killed dead if nobody chooses them. January 31. Yes, you can type up what I wrote about my yellow dog, but leave off the part about the other dogs getting killed dead because that's too sad. And don't put my name on it, please. And maybe it would look good on yellow paper. And maybe the title should be You Come To. February 7th. Yes, it looks good on yellow paper. But you forgot, again, to leave more space between the lines like I did when I wrote it. That's okay, though. 